Hey everybody, it's Ken here with another lantern video. And today I got a couple of battery lanterns here. I have a Chowin Tropic battery and a Deets Comet battery. And the reason for this video is, uh, not too long ago, a subscriber of mine, Paul JS 75 actually sent me a comment. He was watching one of my previous videos that I did on these. And he said, hey, you know, a good idea to be would be to replace the bulbs with uh, with an LED bulb. You know, they have them in warm white, you know, to simulate the, uh, you know, the flame of a lantern and all. And, and I was actually thinking about that for quite some time. And it kind of stirred my, you know, gears in action there. And I said, you know, that probably be a good idea. So I looked into it and I was actually able to find some bulbs online uh yeah they're, they're e10 based that's what these are these are e10 uh i think they're around 60 lumens don't quote me on that and uh these are supposed to be a whole lot brighter and i haven't opened them yet but i just got them and i figure well why don't we uh why don't we give them a try i mean here's the uh here's uh what they kind of look like with the this one here the switch is a little funny on here it gets I have to get it to a certain position there, and it seems to get brighter, but there we go. They're a little, I should spray some contact cleaner probably in the switches. They're very crude switches. It's just a contact, uh, momentary contact on and off, basically a copper a copper conductor. It's either on or off, and it's not rocket science, but so yeah, here we have it. They're, they're probably about the same brightness. I mean, they're, they're both the same bulbs and, and running off of 2D batteries. So why don't I go ahead and try to change out one of them, and uh, first of all, we'll see if it even works, and then we'll, we'll see if it's brighter. So, actually, let me open my package first and see what I even have here. I didn't even open the package yet, but let's see what we have here. Whoa, okay, I don't want to break my lanterns there. Uh, it's a double package. Okay, all right, here we go. LED lights. Okay. They're in okay, three volts. So I don't know if we can open this or if we gotta cut cut this open. Yeah boy, that's still pretty good. Alright. There's supposed to be five in there. They were about ten dollars for five. So that puts it about two dollars a bulb. And they got them really packaged well. Okay, and here they are. They're in a little ziplock. One, two, three, four, five. There's five. Okay, so why don't we grab one out, and then why don't we go ahead and just put it in the Comet. Let's see, now these are a little, I guess the best way to do this, you kind of have to, there's no, there's no uh, connection on these. These just, these are kind of, they're kind of faked out because they're just battery, battery lanterns. They're not uh, burners in there. So let's unscrew that, put the original bulb there, let's see if it fits, it's supposed to fit, it's supposed to be neat, now these are supposed to work off of both polarity too, either, even though they're LED, they did claim in the advertisement that they're reverse polarity protected, now, I don't know how that is, but supposed to be, but since it works that way with the original bulb, I'm hoping that all right, let's see what we got here. Wow! Look at that! That's supposed, supposed to be a warm white. I don't know if I would call that warm white, but uh, supposed they had them in two two. Uh, they offered it in three thousand Kelvin and six thousand Kelvin, and I did pick the three. I did choose the three thousand. It's supposed to be warm white although I don't know it doesn't say that on the package but maybe I got the maybe I got the 6,000 I don't know but be that as it may uh, well, let me get this let me get this to the, the brighter I got I got it there we go yeah wow I would say that's quite a bit of difference there now I don't know about the quality of the light I mean maybe Still might be a better quality with the original bulb, but it'd be interesting to see how long you could run. How long this could run on, on 2D batteries. I bet you this thing might run for three days, two, three days. I, I don't know. But yeah, interesting. 
Be that as it may, um, I guess it'll come in handy if uh, for power failure. Anyway, that's for sure. I mean, I'll be able to be able to use that to get around my house in a power failure, and uh, will probably last quite a bit, quite a long time. So, yeah, pretty pretty good. Not bad. I mean, that was a pretty cool little experiment, and um, I'm glad we did it. Of course, it's daylight out. I still got a little light coming in from my garage windows here, but as dark as I can get it for now. Let's do a comparison here. And let me get this to its brightest peak here. Yeah, well, yeah, it's quite a bit quite a bit of difference. Wow. Although again, like I said, the quality of the light, I don't know. I still think I still like the warmer the warmer uh, element of this incandescent, but it is a whole lot brighter. Yeah, I just wanted to throw this out there. Good little midweek video, you know. Just, uh, I figured I'd shoot a video on it. And thank you, everybody, for watching. Thanks so much. Everybody, take care. And we'll see you real soon with another Laner video. Bye-bye for now.